Iya kan, Nay? Nah, say hello. Yeah, that's Ate Gladys. See, I'm having my family here in the Philippines close to me. Hi guys. So for today's video, I'm going to be doing a drugstore haul just because my handsome husband wanted to treat me at Walgreens. I'm sorry for that sound. I'm about to tell you guys that I am chatting with my mom with my beautiful nanay from the Philippines through Skype. Nay, say hello. Magpakita ka. Kailangan magpakita. Say hello if you can hear her, but she's kind of shy, but you know, you can't see her really, but that's our home there. That's where I grew up, so. So, if you would hear something weird, the background noise, that's the Philippines. So we're gonna go ahead and go on to the products that I bought because I kind of bought a lot but it's kind of like a little bit in the sense of makeup. When we're talking about makeup, a lot is really not existing. We cannot have enough makeup. So the first thing that I'm gonna be talking about is the Real Techniques Expert Face Brush. It's the orange thing. I like Real Techniques brush. Like they're so they're the prettiest brush ever. I like the handle and you know the black thing and everything. It's like so pretty. It's girly and this thing is very cheap. I'm gonna try this one. I probably would try this for cream contouring. It's kind of like tiny and pointed. You know this can be like foundation as well. Like this can this can do good. Like you know. Next is I bought the. Studio 35 Beauty Blender Brush. It has vitamin E in it. That's why I was like so kind of like, hmm, let me try this. And actually, I've been looking for this bad boy here because I saw this uh, being featured at Huda Beauty. One makeup artist was using this and I saw her use this for her contouring, for her concealer and stuff like that. And it was good. That's why I was like, I need that blender blush. What? I need that blender brush. Right now. Like, right now. I think this one is like 4 or $7. This is really good. Unlike having those little blender brushes for your concealers and, you know, for your under eyes. But I don't kind of like that idea because it's kind of small. And you kind of tend to um, include your nails in your fingers on pushing the product and it would kind of leave some marks in it and that's kind of harsh on your face especially if you have this long nails that have designs in it you know so this one is kind of really really good just because of the the hand the handler the handler what on earth it's kind of like handy that's what i mean so I just remember it has a handle I'm freaking stupid next is I bought this Vaseline lip therapy in cocoa butter they have four types actually rose lips creme brulee I forgot the other. I know the other one is the original and this one is cocoa butter. I want this. I chose this one over the three others. This has for soft and glowing lips and I want that. You know, I want soft and glowing lips because my lips kind of tend to dry, especially winter is almost here. The weather is changing from summer. It's kind of rainy and into winter. <laughs> and it has petroleum flavored theriobroma, cocoa, seed, butter. So their thing is really good everything here is good so buying this next is i'm going to be talking about laurier paris advanced hair care total repair 5 motel restorative dry oil it's from normal to fine hair it's their instant repair plus shine leave-in treatment it's kind of like you spray it after you like do your thing at you know shower and then you kind of like dry your hair blow it really good and then you kind of like spray this all over your hair i do have a problem with my hair even though my hair is like freaking straight like ever since i was born it kind of tends to have a lot of baby hair on top of here so 
that's like my dilemma especially when I try to kind of like um, tie up my hair it's like baby hair everywhere and it says that the, the, the oil and everything in here makes your hair fine keeps it in place so I'm gonna try and see if this going to next is I'm gonna be going ahead on the makeup stuff so the first thing is the Maybelline volume express big eyes the falsies they call this the falsies just because they say it makes your lashes long volumized and just look looking like it's lashes so it has like two tips in it the other one probably is for your upper lashes and the other one is for your lower lashes so I'm gonna try this and let's see if it's good next is Maybelline Master Drama I wanted to try this just because Kathleen Lights said this is one of her favorite eyeliners they, she said it's like good so good so I'm gonna try this now these two are both liquid eyeliners. They're kind of like a pen type. I'm gonna see if these two are like damn good or one of them is good or better than the other one. So this one is kind of like thick. Now this one is kind of like really really thin if you can see the difference. So let's see who is better or they're both, if they're both good then I win. You know? So the next one is the Maybelline Superstay Better Than Skin. It's their skin transforming foundation with titanium dioxide sunscreen broad spectrum SPF 15 with Axitil with Actil with Actil C. I don't know how to say it. Oil free. So this one is kind of their new thing after the Fit Me. This one says that it's kind of like treats your skin while you have foundation on that's what it's supposed to do so Kathleen Lights have been using the concealer one which I bought as well but I want to try their foundation that since they do have a pump which is good because the fit me ones doesn't have a pump but this one is good so let's try it if it's good let's try it uh, I just hope it's not freaking dewy I just hope so next is this one. Kathleen Lights have been using this and I wanted to try it. See, it, it, it's, it says it's concealer plus corrector. It targets dark spots, circle spots, and imperfections. So this one does says it treats your skin, corrects your dark spots while you have concealer and coverage on your face. So I hope it's good. It's so next is my Wet n Wild um comfort zone yeah uh -huh. am i right with what i'm saying i want to see how pigmented these things are oh look at that that is very pigmented look at that this is the the definer the crease the eyelids and the bravo i love the colors the colors are good i'm gonna be doing a tutorial on this palette soon just because I love it look at that look how pigmented it is it's freaking pigmented and it's like so cheap you all buy this thing you know and the good thing about this especially if you're just big a beginner it has like each shadow has a instructions where you should put it you know you know for you to learn first color here is for brow bone, for the eyelid, for the crease, and for the definer. So it really does guide you on where you put it, not just, you know, you go ahead, have this palette, and then play with yourself. I like I like how this wet and wild thing is doing it, you know? So one of the last, these are the two things that I'm gonna be talking about. The first one that I have is, I'm gonna be talking about first things. Cause since this one has been like out in the market for a very long time I think I think because I think I'm so late about talking about this thing you might have been using this already and I'm like late you know so the first one is this true match Lumi healthy skin luminous makeup it has octinoxate what on earth is that it's sunscreen it has broad spectrum SPF 20 which is good the makeup artists that I watch have been using this and been loving this that's why I want to try it for myself if it's good I'm in the shade neutral this is like I think this is yeah N5 true beige so I'm gonna try if this one works for me I hope it's not you know it's not dewy 
So the last one that I'm gonna be talking about is their newest highlighter. They say it. The lady at the Walgreens said it's their newest. So it's um, it's got actually like a liquid highlighter. You're supposed to like put it all over your face before you do your foundation or you can mix this with your foundation. It has three shades actually. The one is like ice. Yeah, the one is ice. This one is in rose. The other one is gold. And then I asked the lady at the, uh, at the Walgreens and then she said this one is really really good. She actually kept on telling me that this one would really make your face glow in a very good way, in a very satin, in, in a satin what? In a very smooth and just really natural way. You can mix this with your foundation. So you really need to buy it. I was like, damn girl, yes, I'm gonna buy it. Calm down. So I chose this one over the three. Yeah. So that's it, that completes this drugstore haul. I am so confident that everything that I bought in this bag is gonna be good. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe. If you like this video, click the thumbs up. If you didn't, that's okay. I love you still. Thank you so much for watching. And from the Philippines, now you say hello. Bye-bye.